<laughs> Hello YouTube. I want to do a little update video about my one year back in America after living in Japan. Um, this is a little insight to what my life is like. How to make intros. So let's take a look. California, particularly Southern California, will always be my home. It's where I was born, where I grew up, where I discovered myself, my masculinity, my femininity, the culture that surrounded where I grew up, the culture of my family, culture of my friends. By the way, what even is culture of USA? Question mark? Enjoy this little clip of the first trans person in the history of mariachi. There's someone very important in our mariachi. She just sang. Her name is Natalia Melendez, and she's the first trans woman in the history of mariachi. Give it up for her! The two people who need no further introduction are my two cousins, AJ and Carol. I wouldn't be as close with them as I am today if it weren't for the fact that we grew up together as kids. We've developed a sort of annual summer trip tradition. Previous trips we've gone to see Palm Springs, San Francisco, and this year in 2022 we went to Denver, Colorado. I honestly don't even know if we had any specific reason why we wanted to see Denver. I think it's just because we've never been there before, but we've heard many great things about it in terms of likeness of community, if you know what we mean. I think some of my viewers here live in Denver or live in Colorado, so hello everybody. <laughs> Traveling post-pandemic is such an interesting experience, so the last time we hung out as three cousins was in 2019. It's 2022 now. I just came back from living alone in Japan. Um, the mask mandate finally has lifted, and of course it's freeing, but also this experience kind of taught me, kind of re taught me how to live in the moment. Um, don't take this for granted. Enjoy time and life as it goes, enjoy the summer. By the, by the way, I don't have a script for this video, so I'm just gonna ramble. Um, the, so this is the Denver Botanical Gardens, and I 100% recommend you visiting this place. It is gorgeous, and so many photo ops, and fun places to hang out. Um, don't try to be us and try to walk everywhere. Actually, like, slow down and take in everything. Don't worry, everything will be here, like, nothing will move. Um, so basically, I moved to Japan in March of 2020. Remember how crazy that is? Okay, anyway, <laughs> so I lived in Japan from March 2020 to May of 2022. So I'm making this particular video in May of 2023. So I feel like my life is a timeline of my life in Japan. So I wanted, I, I feel like it really means a lot to me that I'm making this video one year after my return from Japan. Does that make sense? Um, sorry, I'm like being weird, but there, look, there's a cat. Look over there, quotations by Jada Essence Hall. All right, so anyway, our quick review of Denver, Colorado was basically the food was really great. Um, the places were like, were fun, they were okay. Um, but we didn't really like vibe with the people. Um, that can be a conversation with another day. Maybe we just couldn't find the right people at the time. I know there are there are people there are really cool people out there. We just like need to find them. So if you ever want to get us back to Denver, let us know, and we would love to change our review. This video would not be complete without reuniting with my family, my friends, and my alma mater for some reason. By the way, I would never get tired of revisiting UCLA. I'm still connected with a lot of organizations to this day, particularly a lot of alumni organizations. So if you are too, let me know and let's connect. Um, drop the LinkedIn. 
I'm always, always, always down to connect with old friends, new friends, and furry friends. Lots and lots of furry friends. Pop quiz, how many dogs did you count in this video? Comment your answers down below. This is a little day trip I took at San Diego Zoo, and surprise, I live here now. No, not the zoo. I live in San Diego as of 2023. And fun fact about me is I've lived in pretty much all of the counties in Southern California. Los Angeles County, San Bernardino County, Riverside County, Orange County, now, San Diego County. Um, I'm not sure I will ever live in Imperial County though, so let's just, let's just say that I've lived in all of the Southern California counties. You just cannot get any more SoCal than that. I, I think I've accomplished everything it means to be a SoCal boy. So that's pretty much it. That's the video. Um, I just wanted to let you all know that I'm okay. <laughs> I, I survived my one year back in America. I don't know how I did it, but here I am. Um, kicking and thriving. I'm not sure about the thriving part, but we'll see what my future videos are like. Um, I want to keep making YouTube videos. I love this, but you know, procrastination sometimes. Um, thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next one. Subscribe, like, and comment. Bye!